Well, hello everyone, and welcome back to License to Grill. In last episode, we had 22 or 20, whatever customers we had. We had a lot of customers. Just to review real quick the cars that we have. We have burgers, okay? Advertising, more customers. Exclusive, good for more money and patience. Q patience, that is. Uh, not tail patience until you get to the last tier of it, which we're not at that yet. Personalized waiting is irrelevant to us because they can only order burgers and all you can eat. And this one has been a bit... So, so far, the reduction that we've had in all you can eat likely comes back because last round we had seven people order twice, and that would roughly be 30% of what the total would have been, like, additionally, if that makes sense. But we're at day 12, which means at the end of today, we get our last and final card before franchise. I know we have a combiner here somewhere because I locked one in. Still no stinking grabbers. I cannot believe it. So I'm going to buy a combiner. It, it's irrelevant. It's, there's no use for it yet. There's no use for it until we have a, uh, a uh, excuse me, until we have at least one grabber. There's, there's no point for it to use it. We don't need this. I'm debating about buying this. Oh, I am going to buy this, of course. This is this is a no-brainer. And I'll stick this one. Actually, I'll stick this one here and move this over here. It doesn't need to be this close. So this is fine, I think. Because we need, right now, we need grabbers. Like, that's, that's the, the only thing we need are grabbers. We need... Two grabbers minimum, but three grabbers ideal. One to pull from the buns, one to pull from the meat, and then one to pull from the hob onto the uh, prep station. And as far as if that goes, then we want to get a danger hob, but we don't have danger hobs. So it doesn't matter. We have these two, and it's working out okay. Our biggest issue is clearing the tables and keeping um, the, the, ta the, the plates clean. But auto feeding the burgers would be great. Now the question is, do I need a fourth lubricant cabinet? And the answer is... Maybe. And some people would say, yeah, more blueprint cabinets, then you can store more blueprints, then you could re-roll more. And it's like, I hate re-rolling. I hate, I don't say I hate it. But I think we're going to ditch it. So we have one, two, we have six blueprints. I'm going to re-roll one time because all we can afford is one. We're up to 40 coins already. I'm going to try to re-roll to give me at least a conveyor belt. Just give me one and I'll be happy. It gave us nothing but trash. There is nothing here that's even slightly usable. Scrubby brush, meh, maybe, but no. So we're just going to store these again. And, you know, it's like I hate doing this, but it makes sense for us. No research to do today. But we have two things to get conveyor belts. So we just have to be patient and hope to get them, basically. Oh, there's a mess down there already. So we go, of course, we get another combiner because we don't need one right away. Oh, what did I mess there? Oh, I missed a bun. What the heck? That'd be, that's bad, MK. Okay, I'm trying to go, going to go too fast sometimes. Two grabbers, like two conveyors would be ideal. Because we can upgrade three things at one time. Ooh, there's one. Boom, there's one. Give me, give me one more. Give me, if you give me one more, I'll be so happy. I'll, I'll thank the, uh, the played up higher ups. <laughs> if I could get one more. Do, do, do. Yeah, the, the controls are a bit, not wonky today. They're just, I don't know, not working with my hands the way I want them to. But again, we can't call anybody until we get that last, last blueprint. And I'm keeping an eye on it. The only thing I really want is a conveyor belt. That, that's the only thing we can really use right now is another conveyor belt. All right, that's our first double order, which is not a big deal. The trainers interest me, though. Um... I don't. I want to try to hold out for another conveyor belt. If the trainers end up coming around again, I may grab them because I don't think we're having issues with messes here. Because the only spot that can have a mess right now is the spot that right here. That's the only spot that can have a mess that would affect us. Yeah, we'll see. We're, we're still too early throughout the day, in my opinion, to start locking in something like that. Again, we don't need another hob. All right, there's another oil you can eat. Okay, that's then three customers today so far. So I just want to keep that in mind, just to keep a bit of a count. It doesn't, at the end of the day, it doesn't matter. I just want to keep a bit of a count for myself. So we're going to make burgers. Bun it. Bun it. All right, now, now we got the now we got the people coming in. It's not a rush. Um, let's show these first. Now we can do all, we're kind of doing it in batches. Right? We'll make a bunch of burgers. Ooh, another blueprint cabinet. We don't need it. All right, that one there is another double order. So that now is going to be four double orders which is fine I'm so thankful that we have one grabber at least that's so helpful 
well, we'll have one grabber after today. Now, again, we get another card today, and, that, and it could, I always say this, your day 12 card could make or break your run. Because if, you, if you're set up for a certain, you know, setup, and you end up having to change that around, uh, it's not, you know, it's not the easiest thing to do sometimes. How did I miss a bun completely on that one? <laughs> you got people waiting outside. They went doubles? No, we're good now. Ah, stupid gas limiter. So that's a that's a lousy get there. Bang it all. At least okay, there's another one, so that's six. Oh yeah, we need trainers. I should have got the trainers. So that's six double orders. Not a big deal. So 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 far six though is not a lot. Oh, missed that one. Everything's just too tight here. That I'm just keep missing everything. That in. All right. So there's two more. So that's going to be number seven and eight. So eight double orders. But I mean, it's not that bad because they get a new set of a new set of patience bars. Because it's basically you're taking the order twice. So you have to wait for them to, to you have to like wait for them to place their order. You know, stuff like that. All right, one more, and that's it. All right, that's for the day. All right, not bad, not bad, not bad. Now, <laughs> we get our <coughs> final card for this run. Well, until final card until we get to the franchise stage. And I just really hope that we can get... I don't know what card it would be. I don't know what it would be. Oh, yeah, that's okay. Because now it takes that safety hob and it turns it into a slow so it's basically you're dropping it by 0.14 speed because if it's 70 percent 75 percent speed so it means each each one no sorry each 7.5 0.75 speed which means 10 20 percent of that would be 15 so it'll dropping it down to a 0.6 speed so it's, it's a lot slower but i don't want to do uh i mean I would do cheese if you didn't have to chop the cheese, <laughs> but you have to chop it, which kind of is odd. Um, I guess not really, because you don't have like slices of cheese. Or you could almost say slicing the cheese, but it doesn't. It's not in the loaf form. So we have. To, I think we have to go high quality. I think we have to do it. And it it's a. It's going to be a bit rough. I, that I will agree. Now let's see where. Give me my. Give me my freaking grabber. Do we get two? Oh. Oh, baby. Oh, mama. Okay. 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 I'm too excited. Okay. Okay. You see what we have here? You see what we have here? We have this. Boom. And we have this grabber. Now, the question is, do we get... Do we want to make this into a smart grabber? And the only reason why I would do that is because the hobs can sometimes work funny. So I think I do. I think we can get through the day and then uh, this is just a random, it doesn't matter what I put in here. This, I guess. Um, actually, you know what? We have, how many blueprints do we actually have here? We have, we actually have six. You know what? I think it's worth re-rolling one time. And I mean, you know me, I hate re-rolling. But if we, if we can get a danger hob to drop, we're gonna be in excellent shape. Because next tomorrow we're gonna spend 120 coins Oh, shoot, we actually need three. I'm thinking we have a copy desk. No, we actually need three. Three grabbers. Ah, oh, let's see what we get. Maybe we'll get lucky. Give me, give me some luck. Do we buy it? Do we do it again? One more time. I'm, get, I'm getting greedy. Ah. Oh, trainers. Trainers. I'm going to buy the trainers today. And I'm going to keep the grabber. I can't afford the grabber. I'll just take the portioner. I don't need a portioner. Maybe I'll actually keep the dish rack. Just to keep it. So... I can't buy both of these things, but I want the trainers because I think it will definitely be helpful to go faster. Because the speed is the issue. Because I have serving a diner style, I'd be literally in this space right here. But I have three tables, so this up and down, it's just a lot of time. And the trainers, um, well, obviously, it doesn't tell you speed. The only issue is the, is this, is the mess. Um, so as long as we're not walking on mess, which we should not be getting any messes other than right here which I don't have to walk here except one time. Um, I could probably even, can I squeeze by that? 
No, you can't. Okay, that's fine. We'll still do it like that. Um, so the question is, we can't buy the grabber, right? We can't buy the grabber. So I think what we'll do is we'll stick this. We're going to stick this one down here because I, I don't want... Well, you know what? I could... You know what? It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter if it's upgraded or not because a smart grabber costs the same as a regular grabber, which in a sense, it almost should cost more. Um, but then again, it shouldn't cost more. So basically, after today, once we hit day, prep day 14, we can automate making of the burgers, at least somewhat. We can use the bomb. I mean, it's going to be a lot slower, which is why we almost want to get, should have a danger hob. So yeah, we're getting, it's, it's getting to be a bit, a lot harder here now, as far as getting through these customers, but this will be a big help. Let's get our trainers on and let's do our research. We have two researches to do. Um, we got our safety hob. Or yes, geez, I'm, <laughs> safety hobs are up there. We got our smart grabber and we have a grabber. So this is good. This is this is pretty oh these trainers are look how fast I'm as faster I can go. So much better. Again, this this isn't no it's not that noticeable. I mean theoretically it should be. Hold on a second. Yeah. The thing okay, so here's 20% process. So it should be cooking speed. I don't really notice it. So right away we have a double order, which is kind of crappy, but it's okay. We still are looking for grabbers or conveyors, I should say, because we need um, we'll need need a bunch of them. If I see a hob, I'm gonna take a hob. Which getting hob is this late on day 13 is a bit iffy. If you're gonna ha if you're gonna get one, yeah, it's slower because you can tell. That's okay though. Yeah, because before I wouldn't be able to wait for that. It's all good. All right, we got this one, this one here, this one here. All right, so before we had two double orders. Not that bad, actually. Yeah, I really need another conveyor belt. All right, there's another one, so that's going to be three so far, which still is not that many, considering. Again, these runs are so much different than some of the other runs. The runs that have, you know, a lot of prep work are, are significantly different than these. Um, you know, they, they all have their own challenges and their own fun, I guess you would call it. Trainers again, don't need these out. This one out. There we go. So, so far we've only had three. I'm not actually opposed to taking a mixer either, because if we end up getting fresh patties, we're gonna you will need a mixer like a hundred thousand percent, because it's it's so hard to not use a mixer or to, to do without having a mixer. But we'll see. We're getting there. Yeah, you can tell it's slower. Oh, there's another one. Boom. It just thinks that you have to wait for them to become grabbers the next round. But you know what? It's fine. Let's get these dishes out. So like I said, there's only we only had three double orders so far. All right, that's the fourth one. Not a big deal. Still not a big deal. I keep getting things like breadsticks and just stuff that I like. Honestly, I mean, there's a purpose for that. But playing solo, how would I put breadsticks on these tables? Like, how would it be feasible to do it? Right? There's there's certain. I mean, every every item in the game, every appliance, I guess, or decoration has a purpose. Sometimes the purposes don't make sense to me based on what run I'm having. But it doesn't mean that they don't have a function to them. I just, uh, I'm looking forward to the new update. All right, there's another double order. Okay. Not a big deal. Yeah, I mean, we barely have automation. We actually know we don't have any automation. Day 13 for me, Ontario here playing no automation. Day 13. Crazy, right? Crazy to think that. But you don't need automation at all the time. I just like doing automation because you know you know I'm the automation guy. Um, for those of you who are watching this, the, there is a new the new um, Halloween update is coming out October 25th. I don't know when this video will be well is released. You're obviously watching it right you know now if it is released. I don't know what day that's going to be, but there is a Halloween update coming out, which is, is going to be pretty cool. Uh, there's some new, a lot of new decorations, which I'm looking forward to. These guys didn't want double orders because they're saying, nope. Okay, so we only had like five that day. Uh, some new decorations, 
uh, there's going to be some new, a couple new maps. I think one new map or, or a combination of maps. There's different themes. There's one dish who's, or one, like there are no new dishes. What do we got? Give me something good. All right. So we have grabber. We have grabber. Smart grabber. It doesn't matter. Now we can automate burgers. Slightly automate them, which is going to be helpful. After we get that, then they'll pump it. All right. So I'm going to keep the dish rack. I don't need anything else. I mean, another prep station. Another prep station actually wouldn't be terrible. We're going to do a little bit of remodeling. I think I'm going to do another frozen prep. Because then that we can store eight burgers in it, right? So the way I want to do this is I want to have it ending. So it's going to go like this. Now, again, it's going to be a bit slower, which worries me slightly, but having it like this. Um, but it should be fine. Now, this being a small grabbers are relevant for right now. I think, I think this will be okay. Um, the only issue is the buns. Now, do I put the buns? The other thought would be to put the buns here here so then I can grab them uh, I think we're so then we're not actually using this hob anymore so I think we're just gonna have to just maybe I'll put it like this oops sorry maybe put it like that and then I can put a counter here not that I need a counter here but just to put something else here um, and then just I'll shift all these down one like this is the basic automation for burgers I mean, I can even just put the buns here. It doesn't really matter. Just so you can maybe a better visual. Because what will happen is the burgers will come down. Right? Burgers are going to come down. They'll cook. And because they don't burn, um, they'll just sit here. And then the bun will automatically get put onto it. So it's not as fast as two. But there'll be, it'll be a burger will be constantly be ready for me. And this way I can have a couple here. Maybe I'll even put another counter here. Just so I can line more up until we get that. Once we get that other frozen prep station, it's going to go right here. Then I can have eight burgers lined up. And we're still looking for another grabber. Because, I mean, this is going to be a grabber tomorrow. And that's going to feed into this. If we have another grabber, that'll then feed into another one. So, like, yeah, we're... we're but then also, you almost want a danger hub here. Because it's a lot faster. And, and it will still work. <clears throat> but anyway, you know what? We're ready to go here. Uh, we're going to get another grabber tomorrow, guaranteed, because of this. And then we're going to have frozen prep here guaranteed. And we're at 17 minutes. So let's run through. Let's run through the day. Actually, you know what we're going to do? We're not going to do that. Because I want to be able to franchise this in the next run. And I don't want that to be a seven-minute episode. So what we're going to do is we're going to end a little bit early. Just slightly early today. You can see the setup we're going with. I mean, we have no metal tables. We have nothing. The only thing we have, like, we have, this is our only automation, day 14. Can you imagine that? Day 14 is the first time you have automation. It's just crazy. But you know what? This will really help us out. You have 27 customers. We're not still not making a lot of money because we're not calling, but on the, on the blueprint desks, if we get another grabber, I'll take another one. And then aside from that, I don't know. Possibly a mixer just to preempt or prepare, not preempt, but prepare that we're going to get fresh patties. Um, I don't, I don't really know. I mean, or make sure to do cheese because cheese, you know, you need a grabber and a mixer for that, which isn't out of the question either. So I, I don't know. I really don't know what we're going to do here, but we're not going to get another food card until OT day three. So we have day 14, 15, 16, well, day 14, 15, one, two, three. So we have five more days to get through before we're going to get another food card or customer card. I'm anxious to see what franchise card we'll get here because this hasn't been terrible. It hasn't been terrible yet, but I can just imagine that everything's scaling way up <laughs> as you get into the higher tiers. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for joining me. Uh, if you're new to the channel or lurking to, lurking for months, please consider leaving me a subscribe. It would really help out my channel. I'm really trying to get to my next my next goal. Um, and yeah, if you uh, enjoyed the content, please leave me a like. Consider leaving me a like and a comment. I respond to all my comments either with a, with a, with a thumbs up or a heart or I give you a, a uh, personalized comment right back, to, a reply to your comment. I always like interacting with my supporters and my fans, if you will. And yeah, catch me on Twitch Monday and Wednesday evenings at 9 o'clock Eastern, typically doing Played Up. And Sundays for the month of August doing Don't Starve Together. And then we'll see what we get up to uh, as the day is going. If you're following me on Twitch, same name is here, the Ontario Gardener the description. The, the link is in the description below. If you follow me there, you can get all the updates uh, when they happen. 
All right, guys, thank you so much for joining me. We could get more coffee tables too, by the way, if we see one. Thank you so much for joining me, and I'll catch you guys next time. Take care now.